Hello guys. Uh, now we managed to create a simple project in the Spring uh, framework, I mean Spring Boot uh, project, and um, we managed to run it, uh, to run it here, and we see it's running on port 880, and it's Tomcat. I mean it's uh, embedded Tomcat on Spring Boot. Uh, now it's, the problem is that if we want to run on terminal, whenever I want to run on terminal, I'm getting this kind of error, which is saying the build has failed, and in one second. So an exception is saying the tax run not found in a project example. That means the the tax run. Uh, so I'm trying to, to use the tax run in a cradle and it seems that it doesn't exist in, in my project. So I'll show you what I mean. Sometimes you just want to, write, uh, to run your project on, I mean, on command line, uh, which makes it either faster or you are more curious to find out. So what you do, use this command called cradle, run. And so this is what we get. So if in case you have this problem, the only way you can solve this problem, then we have to um, we have to add um, the ID, which ID application, ID application, and then we also have to create the main the main class name and uh, we put at the end of this script so how we do it just that main class name and uh, this is going to be a string and is equal to your main class name which is this one application so how you type it you have to type uh, from your package which is if you might, you might guess you have some com dot example example and then dot application which is the name of the class so that's going to depend on yourself which package you put here so this you have the package if you don't have a package then you have to put this application which is the name of this class here and um and you save and not save most of the time the integer it save automatically so let's try again to run this command and let's see the outcome so now again you already see the outcome is, is different but um it's saying the command um why is it happening like this it's just because we are trying to run it to the command line while it's already running the server is running here and i have to stop the server and let's try again try to send the same command and see so this time i expect that this it has going to run yeah now you see the spring logo and it's already running so if we if we go to the browser and run this then we should expect the result which is hello credo and for those of you who didn't follow me how on a previous example i mean exercise we were trying to see why the Gredo uh, version was different even though we have added the environment variable on our system which was 6.9 but it was showing the current it was failing showing that the current Gredo was another Gredo, which is the one that the intel id has added on our project so in case you have that problem you have to delete this one and then you force which means you have to uh, to go to this Gredo folder here and then you go to the Gredo wrapper properties and then you change this directory and most of the time you just change this end and you just go to the internet and check the, uh, the version you want to uh, the, the approach to use and then use this change this version here to z zip file and then when you try then it's going to automatically download this from this link here so so okay, that's just something small i want to show you because it give it may give you a headache and you spend the whole day finding out why um uh, why the the tax run is not found or is not, uh, not found on your root project so you have to do what i just showed you thank you guys and remember subscribe and bye bye so what you have to do here actually you have to exit uh, which is a uh, control c and then you put y here and then you're out and in case if you you try to run again uh, this project now is offline and uh, if we try to run this again or send this request again it's going to give us what uh, can reach this page anymore because the server is offline thank you guys and stay safe